Yeah, we're here in downtown D.C. where we've just learned that Hillary Clinton's bill to ban coffee has made its way through Congress. More details to come. It's very, very difficult for police to, you know, try and get a handle on this. So like, my name's Drew, I'm 20 years young, and I've been pushing Bean for about uh, five and a half months now. So, I'm kinda legit, been doing it for forever. Bro, I'm just so tired. I'm tired of like the establishment pushing us down, like, I don't know, man. People say I'm like a criminal, not true, man, like, Thing for me is, I'm a businessman. I went to a community college for one, ses one semester, business administration. Uh, I didn't take any business courses. I just took a prereq for English and a prereq for math and like a sociology course. But I still know about business and like I'm, I'm so business minded all the time, man. So for me, it was like an easy gig. I just like hit up this guy I found on Craigslist. He lives in Jamaica. And he'll ship me blends and like, I just sell them, man. People go crazy for this stuff. I'm just always sending out vibes. Listen, do you feel them? I'm like a cell tower of just vibes right now. Oh, shut the camera off, dude! That's it for me, bro. That's it. God drums coffee. You need to know no more about me. They roast the bean over a thousand year old flame. Yeah, they've kept it going for that long and like has a really rich flavor, really gives you a buzz. Yeah, let me know if you're interested. Yeah, that's my boy Sticks. He's in the seventh grade. He's hooked on the bean, and like, I don't endorse it for a young kid like that, but he's got some struggles going on in his life. So, you know, middle school's hard for everyone, and I'm just trying to help him get through. I'm doing, doing the town a good thing, you know, some charity work, I like to think. So, I'm a good guy.